What's up, traders? So let's do an updated multi time frame analysis of gold. Let's see what kind of trading opportunity currently we have as soon as the market open, even tomorrow in the first session of the trading week. As you can see, gold is giving us significant trading opportunity on the lower time frame. Now, before we discuss what it is, let's do a complete multi time frame analysis and then we'll jump onto this time frame to see how we can trade even in the first session of the trading week as soon as the market open we'll be looking at first of all bigger picture monthly time frame now this is the last week of the month as you know that monthly and weekly closing together this week the market will be extremely volatile so first see what kind of price action we have on the monthly perspective now if you look at this overall market on the monthly time frame you can see that this is an extremely falling market if you are following me for some time you have seen from here even here everywhere this is what exactly i was mentioning that gold is likely to drop from here and likely to break this monthly level of support even the price was here the reason i predicted in that way if you look at the top of this candle what you can see gold failed to create any higher high in this uptrending market as a result we have seen that gold has created a new lower look and finally has broken this monthly level of support now as you can see there is no significant level of support nearly in this zone that means that we could potentially see gold came back to this liquidity zone where there are back to back to monthly dodges that means that we still have a long way for gold to drop to this level now, if you look at weekly time frame what we have seen this is what exactly i mentioned in my previous week and in all my analysis including my weekly forex forecast if you look at the weekly chart you can see a clear downtrending market structure starting from here change of trend double top breakdown followed by this retracement consolidation and we have seen another drop followed by 61.8 percent fibonacci level tested this previous support zone here as a resistance and we have seen another drop on the weekly perspective and finally what we have seen there was a narrow dodgy on the weekly has been created which is a very weaker response from the buyers and then finally creating a middleman on the weekly time frame gold has broken out of this previous dodgy grab the liquidity from the top of this dodgy and has broken below this monthly level of support with this weekly candle the past week what we have seen that this close candle is also another continuation pattern when you see this kind of bearish engulfer breakout candle followed by this kind of candle it's a continuation pattern then what we can expect now go to print a couple of weekly candles in this direction at least one more that can give us a significant trading opportunity in this weekly or lower time frame now let's look at daily time frame to see what kind of potential trading opportunity we have now as you can see on the daily perspective this is a nice looking bearish price section this is the last week's trading candlestick pattern you can see that on the daily time frame as well gold has created a bearish structure on the daily time frame you see that this is the trend line the structure bearish st structure the gold has created on the daily time frame which has a liquidity grab at the top you can see that the price grab the liquidity with this long week handle and created this triangular structure and finally has broken down with the, this red candle on the last week of the trading week trading day now what we have seen gold below this important daily weekly and monthly level of support then where we can find potential trading opportunity in the new trading week now if we closely look at we can see a pattern here you can see this is the dodgy which has a green body which has at the top this is the top of this dodgy on the daily time frame and this is the bottom of this dodgy on the daily time frame what i think that as soon as market open we could see a test of this dodgy at the bottom as this is the connection between the top swing low here you can see that this support tested as a resistance with this candle that has completely passed at the top 
and also passed at the bottom and this is the support here acting for this move what i think that in the new trading week we could see significant retracement probably early in asian session or later we could see this support being tested as resistance and we can expect a drop on gold from this zone if we look at intraday time frame on the four hour what we have seen this is what exactly i mentioned in the last day of trading week you have seen that now this doji has formed created a very important level now what we have seen there is a support zone here with this doji support zone here now what we can expect in the new trading week as you can see there are back to back two dodges has been created what i think that we could potentially see a gap opening and test of this previous support zone as a resistance or anyway the market may open in the same zone and then we could potentially see a retest of this important level of support zone here as a resistance and from this zone we can expect gold to melt or drop again and that is the zone that i will be targeting in the first session or second session or first day of trading week for the goal to test this support zone as a resistance as soon as we will find potential trading opportunity from this zone with a bearish price section that we are looking for according to the rules of our strategies i'll be straight going short on gold from this zone with a high probability trade setup with our students now if you find value in this analysis then smash the like button and also don't forget to drop a comment below to help this idea thank you for watching see you soon in my next analysis